Hey guys, dang old nerd. Um, today I just wanted to kind of show uh, some of the the changes I made to my <laughs> cheap airsoft targets or BB traps. Um, and now I, I, I think I made it even cheaper. So um, if you remember before, I used to just take two of these. These are the cake cake pans. Um, that you get, I get them at Walmart, they're like 98 cents for three. But I, I would place two together and then clip them. But um, I decided to change that out because like once you have, you know, the pieces of cardboard inside, it doesn't penetrate all the way through. And this was the previous video where I um, kind of zeroed my red dot. And then I thought I would just take another piece of cardboard and I put some paper over it and taped it up to that. But that got me to thinking, like, why do I even need to have this extra piece of aluminum foil, whatever, the cake pan? I don't even need that, I think. So um, I have this one. <laughs> These are all the BBs. So, um, And then this one is uh, covered with um, packing tape. I noticed that uh, the, especially these plastic airsoft BBs, they don't penetrate the packing tape. I figured that out because when I was shooting, when I was shooting at my target, whenever the BB would hit part of the cardboard that had packing tape on it, it would just ricochet back and that's when I sometimes it would ricochet sometimes it wouldn't and I looked at it and it was, it was the parts that had the packing tape so I decided to just try that and that seems to work because it doesn't it doesn't penetrate this thing so I got two pieces of the cardboard one is the packing tape the other one just sits on top of it but instead of now instead of putting another cake pan on top I can just put a piece of cardboard over it or like this one i've already made up this is <laughs> a, another version of it um these are pie pans they're a little bit different than the cake pans but just to figure that out so the cake pans are a little bit deeper and then the pie pans are a little bit um i don't know kind of wider diameter wise but they cost the same 98 cents for a pack of three so I have, in this one, I have the pie, the pie pan. I have, I think, two or three pieces of cardboard inside. So two pieces of cardboard and then the outside layer. And then I decided to put paper plates on there, you know, like that, that'll be my target. So um, give that a shot, and then I also have same thing with uh, the metal <laughs> cake pan. Um, same thing here inside. I got two pieces of cardboard on the inside, and then this cardboard piece on the outside. And I think I I could put either a paper target or or a, a paper paper plate over it so that just makes it easy to replace so instead of having to actually use two pipe pans you can just use one you have to cut out the cardboard and these paper plates are super cheap so i'll give that a shot
Okay, so here's the results. Open this up. Whoa. <laughs> That's kind of surprising. They didn't even penetrate the first first piece of cardboard. So Seems like the <laughs> Well. Maybe I don't need all of this cuz it didn't even go through to the third so some of them got through to the to the first internal layer but most of them stuck out here and on the actual outside layer kind of surprising um, but maybe it, just the paper plate is enough on the outside and then it'll go through so let's give that a shot Okay, let's check the results. And there's the first layer. Second layer, looks like one penetrated, but it didn't go through the... All right, well, that's my even cheaper <laughs> Target uh, BB trap. Uh, thanks for watching, see you next time.